All right, what is up guys? Welcome to the vlog. I feel like I almost have to reintroduce you to everyone. That back there, my sweet little girl, that is, what's your name? What's your name? You were so excited talking to the camera, you're not going to now? <laughs> okay, well that is London, and I just released, or I just put out a video where I was talking about a student that uh, forgot their stuff at the church. Well, I've got to go to the church now and see if it's actually there. She needs it for school. So London and me, more milk. and London needs more milk. So we are going to go get her milk, go to the church, see if that, that student's backpack is there. Uh, if so, we're going to take and drop it off at her school. What, you want to bop it? She wants to bop it. Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> what she was trying to do is this. For the record, places like gas stations that have a drive-through area are seriously the best. Now, I don't know if my car's running. It is, okay. Because when you have a little one in the back and it's cold and it's raining, you don't want to get them out. But having a drive through is pretty awesome. Okay. Um, so, in that case, I can't actually. I used to be able to vlog and drive, but now I drive a manual. It's not good to vlog and drive anyway, probably. So I'm just, I'm getting to the where I'm about to pull out and then I'm gonna put the camera away. But uh, <laughs> I was gonna go through the drive-through, but no one answered it. So I'm gonna go somewhere where the, they actually do the drive-through thing. Got the backpack, was at the church. So now let's deliver it to the school. Okay. We got the backpack to the student. I think that's the goal. That part of the day is done, but we have something coming up. London, what are we gonna do today? Jump, jump. Woo! We are going to jump jam, are you excited? Yeah! Yeah! Daddy's excited, I love jump jam. <laughs> So we're going to jump jam today. We got to go get mommy. We got to get her up. We're going to go get breakfast. And then we're heading to Knoxville to go to jump jam. Right? Yeah. All right. Say high five. Woo. All right. We got the milk. We got daddy some drink too. Bang. Not a, not, not a sponsor, but bang. You're hit me up. Working. They're, they're not calling. I'm not working. Hmm? Let me see. I'll give you that. That is hard to drink out. I think I just drank out of a sippy on camera. We're not talking about that. All right. Catch you guys. We got to go get mommy up, get her ready, go get breakfast, head to Knoxville, and then drop our little hearts out, right? Go to jump jam. Go to jump jam. Yep. That's the plan. All right, it is a little day la later in the day than we wanted, but we are leaving now. So, jump jam, here we come. And what in the world happened to that thing? So we're on our way to Knoxville on the interstate. And uh, I guess there was like an accident or something, so we had to get off the interstate. But then where we got off, the direction we had to turn, apparently there was a bridge out, so we've had to go the opposite direction. We're not quite sure where it's gonna take us. I'm driving a freaking stick shift. And Jessica's driving a stick shift and traffic jams and stick shifts are not fun. And we're like standstill traffic. Yeah. We're not going anywhere very fast. So we'll, we'll be at Jump Jam sometime today. We are here. London, are you ready to go jump? Yeah. No, no, no. Let's do it. You ready? Mm. All right, mommy, are you ready to jump? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's go. All right, guys. As you we are having a blast, but I'm gonna put the phone up now and just have a good time. So we'll catch you guys later. That was stupid. I should have never said it like that. I'll just, I'll, I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys later. 
Bye. Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Mommy. Dear mommy. mommy. Happy birthday. Thank you. Well, Welcome. I'll do candle. All right, guys, we had a blast last night at Jump Jam London, had fun. We did the rock wall. She, she found this little like ninja course that she just loved to do. She could do like the, the first little part, which she walked on and kind of swung back and forth. Um, but we had just dropped her off with Granny. We are going on a youth trip uh, for the next four days. From today is Friday, yeah. and we'll be back on Monday. We'll be back on Monday. So yeah, it'll be like four days. Yeah. Three days. I don't know. Anyway, we're gonna be gone for several days, so we had to give her hugs and lovings and tell her bye. And tell her bye. And See you but, later. But yeah, but we're going to winter conference, which is the highlight of our youth ministry like year. So we are just we're crazy excited to get that going. We're gonna miss our little girl. Yeah, it's my birthday today. Oh, it's Jessica's birthday. Happy 28. <laughs> Two more years to the big 30. You only have one. Yeah, no, I've been 28 for a while now. <laughs> So it is Jessica's birthday, the day we drop off our baby, the day we're going to winter conference. This is a good day. We're going to kind of vlog this whole week, like combine it all into one video that you're watching right now. So yeah. that's the plan. We're excited. We're excited. Happy birthday to Jessica. Happy birthday to you. She's only three. What's up guys, we are here at the conference. I have no idea if you can hear anything I'm saying, but it is awesome, check it out. We're still fighting against sin. We're still struggling against temptation. And we're still hearing the deceptive voice of a liar named Satan who is always trying to copy what God created and counterfeit what God made. And God still pursues us when we feel shame and we hide from God. Our Heavenly Father is still saying, where are you, son? Where are you, daughter? I know you messed up. I saw it and I love you anyway. God is still pursuing us even when we hide from him. Because I love you so much, I don't want sin to hurt you. Come out of the hiding, walk out of the shadows. I know you, I see you, I love you. And for some of you, this weekend is gonna be the first time in your life that you really do bring it all before the Lord. I just...